honestly i hope the lighting is okay for you guys i'll put like gel all over my hair oh look at ori that's my baby hi guys welcome to my channel i know it's been a while bear with me from the title down below i'm going to do a get ready with me featuring some juvia's place products so um the other day i ordered a couple of things from them so i ordered like more palettes like have a little collection mini collection going on and i ordered the concealer and what else did i order two foundations okay let the fire truck pass it was hard for me to get like a skin match because it's like online and I had to find one that looks like me, I guess, in a sense. So I prayed <laughs> to God that at least one of these match my skin tone because, bruh, I did test some, like I tested them on my skin. I feel like one is too much of a red undertone and one is a little bit too, I forgot what the problem was. I think one was too red and one was too gray i'm not too sure exactly but like i have like golden undertones so um yeah but anywho one is real 430 this is how they look it's velvety matte foundation and the name is called i am magic from juvia's place this is that and the next one that I ordered is called Nairobi and it's for 10. Same look. So the concealer that I have is the I Am Magic Concealer by Juvia's, of course. And it's color 17. It's 17, but it's this one. It's really nice. So I'm going to put this one aside. And then for today's look, the Nubian. Ooh, still has its packaging, my bad. It has these colors. It's very nice. Afrique. It's very pretty. It's a really nice. Vibrant colors. I have the Warrior palette. And I think I'm going to use this one for today's look. So I'll put that aside. This one is my, like, I got these two when I first found out about them. So it's kind of worn out. It's kind of digged out. The pans are really used. So yeah, that is so embarrassing. <laughs> and then I have the Saharan 2. Hope I'm saying that right. Ooh. But yeah. So I'm gonna put these ones away. The one that I'm going to use for today's look is going to be the Warrior palette. So these are the colors. So my face is already washed. I'm breaking out a little bit. From the last video, I hope you guys can tell that I've really been working on evening my skin tones, making my face match my neck, my chest. I've been really trying to take care of my dark spots. I'm breaking out because it's that time of the month for me. Great. And I'm going to go straight ahead and prime. I don't have a primer from Juvia's. I don't even think that they have one yet. I could be wrong. Um, so I'm just going to go in with my NYX Professional um, Makeup Angel Veil Skin Perfecting Primer. It's a long title. <laughs> and I'm just going to lightly go into my T-zones. I don't really do much. Just like that.
Okay, now that that's done, I don't want nobody to come for me. So I usually <laughs> start with my brows. I know there's lots of different people, like some people do their foundation first before they do their brows. Me personally, I can't. I can't start with foundation before I do my brows because I always feel like, you know, what happens if I fuck up and then like I have to like smear and smudge and like go back and like perfect them. So I don't want it to destroy my foundation look, I guess. I don't know. Maybe hopefully there's somebody out there that feels the same way or understands where I'm coming from. I don't know. So I'm going to use the Maybelline Tattoo Studio Brow Pomade and it's in the shade 380 Deep Brown. It just comes in this little thing with a little spoonie. So I'm just going to use that. It's really dark. So normally I just comb through a couple of swipes, turn, make sure that everything's brushed out. Ooh, it's gonna be a little hard. Um, I don't know how I should do this. I should probably take you guys down. That's one eyebrow done. Now that my brows are filled in, I'm going to clean them up, conceal them. And that's where Juvia's comes in. And it has a pretty nice dofa. I like it. It's nice and thick. I just put it on the back of my hand like so. I just Go over here. I just do a little bit around the tail.
the access concealer that I have on the back of my hand, I like to dip and put on the lids of my eyes. A little base for my eyeshadow. And when that's said and done, I wanna go in with my Markel face powder. Yep. So I just take it, blow, and apply. I'm just going to see which colors I prefer using for today. And I'm gonna mix it with the Nubian palette, I think. Yeah. Okay, so first off, I'm gonna start off with a nice transition color. This one and that one. I'm gonna go in with this one to start me off. And I'm gonna just dip into it right here. Get a nice amount, tap it off. I'm gonna go in. I'm gonna go back in and do the next side. Oh I think I'm going to go in with this that brown shade here. So from the Warrior palette, I'm going to go with this shade and it's called Mino. Mino, Mino, Mino. I think I'm gonna go in with um, Bakwa. So it's this shimmer, this shimmer right here. Use my fingers and rub it a little bit. It's very pigmented. blend everything all together I'm just gonna go in here a little bit it's 
So I want to give you guys a close up. I want to go in with my foundations. It's kind of hard to tell, so I'm going to give myself like a little swatch. This is the Rio 430. And I want to just put a little bit on my finger. And swatch. Hell no! To the no, no, no! <laughs> Nairobi seems like it might be a match. So again, dry hands, clean hands. I'm gonna put Nairobi right here. So I'm going to use Nairobi just for the video sake just so that we can have a beat face. And we're just gonna keep it moving. With my foundation brush. And have my, have my setting spray ready. So let's just do that. I'm just gonna take like a little blob of Nairobi. Give myself a couple of swipes. And with my NYX matte finish spray, go in with my concealer.
I'm gonna go back in with my Markel. Just to highlight some. I don't bake for long at all. Um, I can't tell when's the last time I did. I just quickly just go over the spots that I highlighted with my concealer. I'm going to go in with my NYX no filter finishing powder in mahogany i'm going to use this to low light my face i'm going to see if i can try to make this foundation blend and okay. that's that fit me powder 330 toffee and then i'll warm up my eyes a little bit I'm going to take Juvia's highlighting powder. I think this is the Nubian Loose Highlighter. And does it say? This one's called Nefertiti. Um, and it's more like a rose gold. It's really nice. A lot of product though god damn Ooh. i have a little bit from my previous wear <laughs> product oh look at all of that sparkles everywhere i'll apply a little bit more oh okay i said a little but okay I'll distribute. I fucks with it though. I fucks with it though. Put a little bit on my nose here. And the bridge of my nose. And I am finito. I also bought another one. Another um, highlighting powder. And it's this one. And this one's... It doesn't have a name. Let me see. Oh, this one's called the Nubian by Juvia's Nefertiti. Then this one's the Royalty 2 by Juvia's Loose Highlighter. So yeah, it's different ones. I'm going to use my Maybelline New York, uh, the Colossal Big Shot Volume Express. Mascara mixed with my Revlon Ultimate All-in-One. I do double the mascara because I like the the dramatic eyelash look. When it comes to lashes, I always order like wholesale lashes from AliExpress and stuff. So this is the one that I'm going to use for today. I already have a pair out. So I'm just going to, if I can find it, shit. Where did I put it? 
don't come for me. I use glue, weave glue. So I'm just gonna take the lashes and then put some glue on the track. Say hi, Ori. She's so cute. Oreo, say hi. Mama. She's so cute, guy. Oh, she's running. Oh, forgot lips. Mm, I was gonna use my Plum Baby by Revlon. This is the finishing look. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me give you guys a close up. What do you guys think? Yay or nay? This highlighter though. Well, that is it. Just a quick get ready with me featuring some Juvia's place products if you guys like what you see and you want more of these videos please comment down below let me know on social media as well and i could definitely make millions more for you guys also see my socials down below in the description box don't forget to like share comment and subscribe tell a friend to tell a friend about me and thank you so much for watching Hope you guys have a great day. Happy holidays. And don't forget to stay golden. Bye, guys.